Hey guys, welcome back to World of Warcraft. This is episode 35, and today we're back in Dustwaller Marsh for hopefully the last time. So let's get started. Okay, guys, uh, the only quest we've got is Is it real? We have to talk to Nat Pagel at Nat's Landing in Dustwaller Marsh. So it's just over there, across the water. I think we'll have to do a bit of swimming. So yeah, as I say, uh, this is hopefully the last episode of Dustwaller Marsh. We've just got one chapter left to go, the Terror of Feramor. And uh, then we can move on to a new zone. Okay, there's Nat. By the way guys, uh, I've been very busy lately playing uh, Season 5 of the Grim Dawn Community League. Uh, I'm currently levelling a Battle Mage and a Warder. So yeah, do check it out if you like uh, Grim Dawn. It's uh, really fun. Okay, let's speak to Nat Pagel. You need something? So it's going to involve a lot of alcohol and some embarrassment on your part. See you around. Okay, so we have to smear Pagel's fish paste, extra strength, on yourself, then swim into Tide Fury Cove. And for that, we get some Dark Moon Special Reserve. See you later. Okay. Looks like we've got some horde company. Stormbite. Okay, let's swim back. Okay, let's speak to that. Hello. Have a good one. Safe travels. Okay. So we have to speak with Major Mills at the docks in Faramor. See you around. I think I know what this quest is. Yeah, let's head back to Faramor.
This is my uh, second recording session of the day. I've uh, just come off recording uh, Feed the Beast Infinity Evolved, episode 17. So uh, do check that out if you're into Minecraft. It uh, comes out every second Sunday, so once a fortnight. Okay. Okay, Major Mills. Greetings. Have a good one. Okay, cool. We get a two-handed pole on, just in case we go retribution. So we have to use the mortars to defeat Tefe. For the alliance. Okay. There it is. I haven't picked up the quest. Can I help you? Oh, there we go. So uh, we basically basically just run around clicking these mortars until it's dead. Okay, he's almost dead. I need to get closer. I don't have a target. Yes, there we go. Okay, let's speak to Major Mills. You need something? 
Well done, Horathian. I'll admit, when I caught my first glimpse of that beast, I had doubts about our ability to defend the docks, but you held together the, the defenders brilliantly. And we get a sea monster harpoon. Be careful. Boom, there we go. So we'll save that in case we go retribution. And to celebrate, let's drink uh, some Dark Moon Special Reserve. Okay, guys, uh, that appears to be it for Dust One Marsh. Seven out of seven chapters. So I think we're going to head back to Stormwind. Oh, typical. Yeah, we're going to head back to Stormwind. And uh, I think we'll be able to get to the Exodar from Stormwind. So I'll be right back. Okay guys, the ship has just arrived. So we're going to take the ship back to the Eastern Kingdoms. Then uh, we'll take a flight to Stormwind. And hopefully we can uh, go to the Exodar via the Mage Tower. Okay, here we are, back in the wetlands, Benethil Harbour. Okay, let's take a flight to Stormwind. I think I'm just going to open the window. It's very hot here today.
Well, I haven't been here for a while. No shy Abbey, where it all started back in episode one. And here we are, Stormwind, home. I think I'll just check in on the trading post whilst we're here. See if there's anything new. Adventurer. I'll be right here when you need me. In. Okay, I think it has to be the Mount Reigns of the Magenta Cloud Serpent. Let's purchase it. Got it. Okay. Let's open that. Let's add that to the favourites. Okay. Now let's head up to the Mage Tower in the Mage District. The Mage Quarter, sorry. And hopefully there will be a portal to the Exodor. If there's not, then it means a long journey back to uh, Kalimdor. Oh cool, Blinktron. See if we get them out. No. Okay, Exodar, Exodar. That's uh, Wrath of the Lich King. Exodar, perfect. So this will be our first Burning Crusade content. That's a portal back to Stormwind. Okay. I can never remember how to get out of here. I think it's just up the ramp over there. Then uh, we'll make our way to uh, Azumi style. May the light embrace you. Now I'm just wondering what level the mobs are in this zone because I'm currently on cat Cataclysm Time Walking. Oh yeah, the level 57, perfect. Okay. 
I was worried that they'll be like level 10 or something. But no, they're level 57. So that's fine. So I'm going to head to this island here. I'm in Vale. And uh, we'll get started with the quest. This is probably one of my favourite zones in World of Warcraft. Just beautiful. So peaceful and tranquil. It looks gorgeous as well. Let's get some copper. We'll get that quest uh, when we come through here, when we come out of the zone. Same with that one. Okay, here we are. Ammon Vale. And I think the crash ship is just over there. Wow, it's been years since I've been here. But uh, it looks very familiar. Okay, trivial quests are on. Okay, let's speak to this guy, Proentius, Proentius. So we have to acquire six vials of moth blood from the nearby Vale Moths and bring them to Pro Proentius at the crash site in Amund Vale. And we get a crappy pair of braces. Let's see if there's any vendors in here. Hope you find something useful. Sell some of this crap. May your days be long and your hardships few. Okay, I think we'll do this quest, then uh, we'll call it a day because uh I would like to start this zone on a new episode.
got a new shield transmog. Oh yeah, let's uh, let's try out the mount that we just got. Uh, the magenta cloud serpent. Wow, this is cool. Take a screenshot. Okay, I think I'm going to hand in this quest. Then we'll be back next week. Uh, then we can start the zone properly. Good fortune. Have you harvested the necessary moth blood for the healing crystals yet? With survivors scattered all over the Vale, time is of the essence. Favor the road traveled by few. Regrettable that those creatures had to die so that we might live. Indiscriminate killing is not the Junai way. And we get some slightly rusted braces. Do not lose faith. Okay, so next episode, we're going to deliver the bundle of vials to Zaldun at the crest site in Aaron Vale. Blessings upon your family. And uh, let's just get these this quest here whilst we're at it. May the light embrace you. So we have to kill eight volatile mutations, then return to Botanist Terex at the crash site in Amon Vale. Seek the path of the light. Okay guys, I'm going to call it there for today's episode. Sorry it was a shorter episode than usual, but uh, I do want to start this zone properly next episode. So do look out for that. In the meantime, please leave a comment, please like, subscribe, all that good stuff, and I will see you in the next episode. Goodbye, guys.